Right, folks, I do hope you're all well, I really do. Last one of the night for me, and it happens to be a scores on the doors section. Um, not been a lot to report on today. It's been a very quiet day. I've been mad busy. I've looked and looked and looked for stuff. Only got about four messages out. This is the fifth and last. We'll quickly go through the scores on the doors. Uh, what did the Watchman do? The Watchman give you an each way free bet, an each way shot at 11 to 2. His last one was 11 to 13. This was 8 to 13. So they're coming up the field slowly but surely. 8 to 13, so not so well. Uh, he did give a winner 8 to 13, but anybody could have done that. Um, Andy, Andy gave 3 out, 1-1 one, one at 3 to 1 on SP. May have been bigger when he gave it out, I don't know. So all you've done is levels your devils. Uh, what else have we got? Uh, we've done the Watchmen. He's given us one for tomorrow as well. We can't wait for that. Peter gave one out, uh, no joy. Uh, and I think that was it. I think most everybody else have abstained. Connor's not done anything today, I don't think. The Veil has done nothing, I don't think. Uh, Dave the Suits hasn't bothered, from what I can see. Um, the Glorious hasn't been back for a while, so nothing. That leaves us with the last one, the old mystery guy. And I, I, pr I promise you, folks, it's not me. It really isn't. Um, I got a message of somebody last night saying, could I show all his bets? Because he gives some uh, shorter price ones as well. Look, I put one, two, three, four, five out there last night, folks. And I, he's sending me loads of bets. He does more than this. I talk a lot. You know that already. <clears throat> he types a lot. He can send me three or four messages within an hour. And each message is really, really, really long. And I think because he's really rushing it, typing up because he's doing loads of other stuff, a lot of the pronunciation and spelling's wrong. I'm not knocking you, sir. I'm not knocking you one iota. But some of them are hard for me to follow. And there's thread after thread after thread. He sent me some for tomorrow. I'm only going to give you a couple. Reason being is a lot of shorter priced. More about that in a moment. But let me go through the five that he gave. He gave five out yesterday. Uh, and the six o'clock, he had a 12 to one uh, to place. First four came nowhere. Um, in the seven o'clock, he gave one at 13 to two. It placed, but ended up being seven to two. He gave it out at 13 to two. In the last race, the 8.30, um, he gave blue collar tonight. I actually seen that race. Well, I seen the finish. That's all I seen. With a better jockey, the better ride, that would have probably have won. It got in all kinds of trouble. Finishing like a train, but it placed fourth place. It paid out. He gave it eight to one again. It ended up seven to two. But the bigger he gave out, the big race for him was the seven thirty. He gave two in that one called Meng Tian at twenty to one came nowhere, and one called Fast Affair at fourteen to one. I think it SP'd at sixteens. It won at sixteen. So if anyone's bet them, a really really great day. But he gave four or five more to me, and he mentions he does doubles, he does trebles, he does tricasts. I'm making decisions based on just me. I don't want to give out everything he does, folks, because what I don't want to do is give loads of selections there, lots go down and only one or two plays, and he looks bad, because I know he's good at what he does. Although he's giving me loads, he's doing even more. That This guy is a, like an animal for the amount of bets he puts on. I've seen some of the stuff he does per day, and it's unbelievable. He's just sending me certain ones. When, when he sent me the first couple of bets in the last couple of weeks... He gave me a couple, he said, this will place, this will place, blah, and the price will collapse, and they have done. With some of these, the last two days, the prices haven't collapsed, he's been wrong, but they've still ran well as, as they have today. But I'm, I'm woke, I just don't want to give all these extra bets, folks, and people start betting them all and lose loads of money. I don't want any people losing money through my channel, which is why I said, after seven days, if this wasn't working, and this guy was doing his brains in daily, but I doubt that'll happen, but if that was the case, I was going to stop giving the bets out, because I don't want to help you into the poorhouse folks i really don't now as i say he's given a few out tomorrow but i'm just not going to give them I, i've picked two outsiders because there's only two big price ones tomorrow don't mean say they'll win don't mean say they'll place but i'm giving two out and just a bit of background on today's bets he gave today's bets yesterday to me which i passed on to you and he sent me loads of messages about three four five o'clock today i've only read them at seven half past seven today I'm worried about them, I'll give you, I'm worried about them, they might not come in, they might not, the drawers are poor, the blah, 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 I'm struggling to pick horses for tomorrow, the ground's atrocious, it's atrocious everywhere, we need some sun, I'm picking some for tomorrow, but the, the horses that should do well under normal circumstances, but the rain and the forecasts are really throwing me, he said they'll be throwing all tipsters, which is why so many tipsters are abstaining today, they've not bothered, he said it's really difficult because the ground's so up and down, you need some consistent good to firm ground he said and we're nowhere near it at the moment he said and it's a real worry he said so them that you put up for me from last night he said they may run well he said but i've not got the confidence in them i'd like to have then he, he sending me a message saying boom 
So I thought one of them must have won, and then I looked and it had won, which I was pleased for. Because if any of you bet them, you're well ahead today with a 16 to 1 winner. But even he was worried. So he's given the tips, and today he was worried. But then one of them got him out of the doo doo. So 16 to 1 winner, um, 13 to 2 placed, 8 to 1 placed. That was as given. Um, sorry, the 16 to 1 winner was 14s. It ended up 16s. The placed horses both come in. If anyone got on, you got in earlier. I've got two for tomorrow that is given. I've only took two of the big price ones. In the five o'clock at Kempton, Artisan, he's got it as 11 to 1, four places, go each way. 11 to 1, 505 at Kempton, four places. And in the 457 at Nottingham, that's the 457 Nottingham, Pledge of Honour, uh, that's 20 to 1. I don't know if that's three or four places. If you can get four places and worse odds, I would go that way rather than three places. But they're the only two I'm going to give you that he's given me today. He's given me about five more. They're all shorter prices, a lot shorter. And some might say, just give them all out. I don't want to. Because if I start doing that, many other folk, the guy that's asked me to give them out, other folk, I'll want to bet on everything. And I'm worried to death that if they don't come in, you're going to lose a lot of money, folks. And I just don't want that to happen. Whereas if you're having two small plays on two each way, if just one of them frames, you've possibly got your money back, you know, at them prices. Especially if the... 20 to 1 of frames, you've got your money covering both bets there. Let's hope it does. Okay, that's it for me. That's the scores on the doors. I know I've rambled, but I, re I had reason to ramble, and I do apologise. But as I keep saying, folks, and I mean this, these bets aren't me. It's nothing to do with me. I couldn't pick us at them prices or whatever else. I'm, I'm not that clever. Um, but I hope some of, you, some of you have won some money today. I really do.